Ever wondered how betrayal shaped the course of history? Get ready for a roller coaster ride through the top 10 scandals that rocked the world. Now, when we think of betrayal, we often think it's a personal matter, but it's much more than that. It's a game of intrigue, a dance of deception, and it has the power to change the course of history. Today, we're going to explore 10 monumental betrayals that left their mark on the pages of history. So buckle up, history buffs and mystery lovers, for a thrilling journey through time. Stick around as we delve into the first scandal that left an indelible mark on history. Number 10. Imagine being betrayed not by an enemy but by a friend. That's exactly what happened to Julius Caesar. Picture this. You're the ruler of the Roman Empire, respected and feared by many. But your close friend Brutus harbors a deep resentment. He sees your ambition as a threat to the Republic and conspires with your political adversaries. The Ides of March, a day that will forever be synonymous with betrayal. Brutus, along with other senators, leads you into the Senate House under false pretenses. Then, in a chilling moment, the daggers come out. You fight, but the onslaught is too much. And there, among the faces of your assassins, you see Brutus. The shock, the pain, the betrayal, it's all too much. With your last breath, you utter the now infamous phrase, et tu, brute. Betrayal can come from those closest to us, as Julius Caesar tragically discovered. But what happens when betrayal is part of a larger conspiracy? Number 9. Picture this. A plot to blow up the king and parliament. Sounds like a movie plot, right? But it's a real historical event. Welcome to the year 1605, a time of religious tension in England. A group of English Catholics, fed up with the persecution they faced, hatched a plan that would alter the course of history. They aimed to assassinate King James I and replace him with a Catholic head of state. Their weapon of choice? 36 barrels of gunpowder stashed beneath the House of Lords. The plot thickens, right? But here's the twist. One of the conspirators, Guy Fox, was caught red-handed guarding the explosives. Betrayal, you ask? Most certainly. An anonymous letter sent to Lord Monteagle, warning him to stay away from the Parliament, was the key to the plot's unraveling. The warning letter led to a thorough search of the Parliament building, ultimately foiling the plot. The conspirators were rounded up, tried and executed, marking a bloody end to their ambitious plan. The gunpowder plot, as it came to be known, is a stark reminder of the lengths people will go to for their beliefs. It also serves as a testament to the power of betrayal. One letter, one act of treachery, and the course of English history was forever changed. In the face of danger, one person's betrayal can save many lives. But what happens when deception becomes a way of life? Number 8. Can you imagine leading a double life as a spy? This was the reality for the members of the Cambridge spy ring. Our story takes us to the heart of the Cold War, where the lines between friend and foe blurred in the shadows of espionage. It was in the prestigious halls of Cambridge University that a group of young men found themselves drawn into a world of secrets and subterfuge. These were the Cambridge spies, a ring of British intellectuals who spied for the Soviet Union, their deceit reaching deep into the fabric of British society. Their motivations varied. Some were disillusioned by the inequalities of the capitalist system, others were seduced by the allure of the Soviet ideology. But all of them shared a common thread, a willingness to betray their country for a cause they believed in. The extent of their deception was staggering. They infiltrated the highest echelons of British government, leaking sensitive information to the Soviets over a span of two decades. Their actions sent shock waves through the corridors of power, forever altering the landscape of international politics. Yet, despite their treachery, they were never brought to justice. Their lives ended not in a prison cell, but in the comfortable obscurity of a foreign land, leaving behind a legacy of betrayal that continues to haunt us. Betrayal and deception can change the course of history as we've seen with these remarkable scandals. Remember, things aren't always as they seem. Number 7. We're stepping back in time now to the intrigue-filled court of the Tudor dynasty. The 16th century was a time of seismic change in England, and at the heart of it all was the Tudor family, a dynasty marked by scandal, conspiracy, and betrayal. Imagine the court as a stage where every player is engaged in a high-stakes game of power. The most infamous of them all was King Henry VIII, whose desperate quest for a male heir led him to betray his wives, his friends, and his faith. His first act of treachery was against his wife of 24 years, Catherine of Aragon, who he cast aside to marry Anne Boleyn. But Anne's fate was no better. Accused of adultery and treason, she was executed on the orders of the very man who had once risked everything for her love. 
But betrayal was not limited to the king's bedchamber. It permeated every corner of the court, from the ambitious courtiers who plotted against each other to the religious reformers who risked their lives to defy the king's authority. Even Queen Elizabeth I, daughter of Henry VIII, was not immune. She was betrayed by her cousin, Mary Queen of Scots, who sought to usurp her throne. The Tudor court was a world where loyalty was a commodity, trust was a luxury, and betrayal was a tool for survival. It was a world where the line between ally and enemy was constantly shifting, and where the price of power was often paid in blood. As we delve deeper into the annals of history, we find that betrayal is not just a modern phenomenon, but a timeless aspect of the human condition. Number 6. Now we turn our attention to the land of pharaohs, to the enchanting and beguiling Cleopatra, the last active ruler of the Ptolemaic Kingdom of Egypt. Known for her intellect and irresistible charm, Cleopatra was not just a queen. She was a player in the high-stakes game of power. Her notorious love affairs with two of the most powerful men of Rome, Julius Caesar and Mark Antony, were more than just passionate romances. They were strategic alliances, political maneuvers, and ultimately, tales of betrayal. Julius Caesar, besotted by Cleopatra, extended his stay in Egypt, causing a stir in Rome. Their alliance strengthened Egypt's position and Cleopatra's hold on her throne, but it also set the stage for Caesar's downfall. His assassination, a betrayal by his closest allies, left Cleopatra vulnerable. Enter Mark Antony, a man of power and influence in Rome, and Cleopatra's next lover. Their alliance was seen as a threat by Rome, leading to a war that ended in Antony's defeat. Betrayed by Cleopatra during the naval battle of Actium where she withdrew her fleet, Antony took his life believing Cleopatra had already done the same. Cleopatra's story is one of power, passion, and betrayal. Her alliances with Caesar and Antony were not just love affairs but strategic moves in a game of power. Yet in the end, these alliances led to their downfall, the allure of power, the intoxication of love, and the sting of betrayal. Cleopatra's tale is a timeless reminder that in the game of power, loyalty is often a casualty. Stay with us as we delve deeper into the annals of history, revealing more tales of deceit, treachery, and betrayal. Number 5. From ancient Egypt we jump forward to 20th century America, to a scandal that rocked the foundations of one of the world's most powerful nations. The Watergate scandal, a story of political intrigue, espionage, and betrayal at the highest levels of power. In the early 1970s the United States was gripped by a political scandal that led to the only presidential resignation in the nation's history. Richard Nixon, the 37th President of the United States was implicated in a cover-up following a break-in at the Democratic National Committee headquarters at the Watergate office complex. The subsequent investigations revealed a web of political spying, sabotage, and bribery that led straight to the White House. Despite Nixon's attempts to obstruct justice, the truth emerged thanks to the persistent efforts of two Washington Post journalists, Bob Woodward and Carl Bernstein. The scandal resulted in Nixon's resignation and a crisis of confidence in American politics. The Watergate scandal served as a stark reminder of the potential for corruption in the corridors of power and the importance of a free and diligent press in holding those in power accountable. The echoes of Watergate still reverberate in modern politics reminding us of the fragility of trust in our leaders and the importance of transparency in government. The scandal serves as a warning to those who would misuse their power, a testament to the courage of those who seek the truth, and a lesson in the ultimate price of betrayal. Number 4. We now journey back to the Renaissance era, a time of great upheaval and transformation, to explore the work of one man whose teachings have influenced countless leaders and shaped the very essence of political strategy. That man is Niccolo Machiavelli, an Italian diplomat, philosopher, and author, best known for his political treatise, The Prince. Machiavelli's principles, often termed Machiavellian, advocate for the ruthless pursuit of power, even if it means resorting to deceit, manipulation, and betrayal. His teachings have been linked to several historical figures such as King Henry VIII of England, who famously manipulated religious institutions for his personal gain, or even Joseph Stalin, whose regime was marked by political repression and purges. But Machiavellian tactics are not confined to the annals of history. They persist in our modern world, with leaders using manipulation, fear, and deception to maintain control. From the political chess games within corporate boardrooms to the strategic maneuverings on the global political stage, Machiavellian principles continue to shape our world. Perhaps most alarmingly, we see these tactics employed in the realm of social media and digital information, 
where misinformation and manipulation can sway public opinion, incite fear, and even influence the outcome of elections. In this digital age, the Machiavellian art of power and deception has found a new playground. As we delve further into the depths of betrayal, we must ask ourselves, how do we navigate a world where Machiavellian tactics are so deeply ingrained? And how can we foster transparency, honesty, and integrity in a landscape that often rewards the opposite? Number 3. As we shift our attention from the political arena to the glitz and glamour of Hollywood, we uncover a different kind of betrayal, one that often lurks behind the dazzling lights and red carpets. Welcome to the world of Hollywood's dark secrets, where reputations are made, shattered, and sometimes deceitfully maintained. From the golden age of Hollywood to the present day, the entertainment industry has had its share of scandalous stories and shocking betrayals. Take, for instance, the infamous Hollywood blacklist era during the 1950s. Fueled by the fear of communism, many talented artists were betrayed by their colleagues and unjustly barred from working in the industry, their careers ruined forever. Fast forward to the 21st century where the Hash Me Too movement has uncovered a web of deceit and abuse of power within the industry. The Harvey Weinstein scandal, for instance, revealed a grim reality of sexual exploitation and betrayal, shaking the very foundations of Hollywood. The world of Hollywood is not just about fame and fortune, it's also a world where trust can be easily broken, secrets are kept hidden under a veil of glamour and betrayal can have devastating consequences. But these scandals also serve as a powerful reminder of the importance of transparency, accountability and justice. They force us to confront the uncomfortable truth that power and influence can be used for harm, but they also inspire us to strive for change. As we peel back the layers of Hollywood's dark secrets, we are reminded of the power of truth, the courage of those who speak out, and the hope for a more honest, more responsible industry. Number 2. Now let's switch gears and venture into another equally glamorous and highly competitive world, the world of sports. But don't let the cheering crowds and shiny trophies fool you. Just like Hollywood, the sports world too has had its fair share of scandals, betrayals, and deceptions. From match-fixing allegations in cricket and doping scandals in cycling, to the infamous 1919 Chicago White Sox incident, where players were accused of intentionally losing the World Series, the sports world is no stranger to the dark side of betrayal. And who can forget the shocking revelation of Lance Armstrong's doping scandal? A hero in the world of cycling, Armstrong's fall from grace was a classic tale of betrayal, a betrayal of his fans, his teammates, and the very essence of sportsmanship. But it's not all doom and gloom, folks. Amidst these stories of deceit, there are also tales of redemption and resilience. Take the case of the Boston Red Sox who, after enduring a heartbreaking 86-year championship drought, or as fans like to call it, the curse of the Bambino, finally emerged victorious in 2004. So whether it's the thrill of victory or the agony of deceit, the world of sports never fails to deliver high-stakes drama. But at the end of the day, it's not just about the scoreboard or the trophies. It's about the spirit of the game, the passion of the players, and the unity of the fans. And as we continue to peel back the layers of betrayal and deceit, we are reminded of the power of truth, the importance of integrity, and the enduring allure of sports. From the glitz of Hollywood and the adrenaline rush of sports, we finally reach the number one spot as we delve into a world that is far more cryptic and shadowy, the realm of cyber espionage. Our next tale of betrayal takes us into two equally shocking tales of betrayal that shook the whole world. The first one takes us to the heart of the United States National Security Agency, a place where secrets are currency and trust is as fragile as a house of cards. Edward Snowden, a former NSA contractor, shocked the world when he leaked classified information about the agency's global surveillance programs. His actions exposed the extent of governmental spying on its own citizens and raised serious questions about privacy and individual rights. Snowden was hailed as a hero by some, a whistleblower who dared to reveal the truth. However, to others, he was a traitor, a man who betrayed his country and endangered national security. Snowden's story is a complex web of betrayal and deceit, where the lines between right and wrong, hero and villain are blurred. But regardless of how one views his actions, there's no denying the impact of his revelations. In the end, Snowden's tale serves as a stark reminder of the power of information, the importance of transparency, and the high stakes involved in the world of cyber espionage. As we continue to explore the theme of betrayal, we are reminded that it can come from the most unexpected places and have far-reaching consequences. 
and such is the case of our second number one most shocking betrayal in history that changed the world. Stay tuned, you won't believe it. As we've journeyed through the annals of history, we've seen betrayals that have caused wars, toppled empires, and changed the course of history. But in the digital age, betrayals look a bit different, yet their impacts are just as profound, if not more so. And this is where we find our second number one shocking betrayal that shook the whole world. Imagine this, you're scrolling through your Facebook feed, liking a cute puppy video here, sharing a friend's vacation photo there. Little did you know you were part of one of the biggest data breaches in recent history. Enter Cambridge Analytica. This British political consulting firm harvested the personal data of millions of Facebook users without their consent and used it for political advertising. You heard it right, folks. Your likes might have influenced an election. Now that's a plot twist even we couldn't have scripted. The scandal rocked the tech world and led to a global conversation about data privacy, digital rights, and the power of social media giants. This is a betrayal of a different kind, where our trust in tech was shaken. It's a stark reminder that in the digital age, information is power, and those who wield it can shape not just our online experience, but our real-world decisions as well. So folks, as we wrap up our journey through the world of betrayal, we hope you've enjoyed this roller coaster ride of deceit, treachery, and yes, the occasional heroics. Remember, in this world of smoke and mirrors, it's always best to question, to probe, and to seek the truth. Before we sign off, we'd love to hear from you. Which of these betrayals shocked you the most? Are there any other epic betrayals you think we missed? Drop your thoughts in the comments below and let's get the conversation going. Until next time, keep your friends close, but your secrets closer. This is your ever-intriguing narrator signing off.